Welcome, folks, to another episode of Swords Drawn, Guns Loaded. Hey, and I am your host, Damon. Hey, welcome back. Good to see everybody. Uh, like I said I kind of missed uh, two weeks ago. Do the show every other uh, every other Saturday night, 10 p.m. Central Standard uh, to midnight. Got all our info up there as far as the Twitter channel that we're on, where you can catch our past episodes on YouTube. And where you want to go for uh, information, go to grievancegaming.org. Join up with us. We play uh, lots of MMOs. Hey, Jane. Katie Fraggle, Jane. <laughs> so check Grievance out. You can catch lots of shows. This is like the, I believe, maybe the 40th show now. I mean, quite a number of them. And even though I got this one, Elder Scrolls V Skyrim, uh, on my opening... Uh, intro there, which you might have seen. I've never actually played it for the show, and it's a good one because games like, uh, like I played in the past, Fallout uh, 4, and uh, a game I didn't play. But if you ever play like some of the Rocksteady games, um, they uh, stuff will happen. You can go into the game, you can have something in mind to do, and the game will make sure you're not bored. It will throw something at you. You know, um, so just a quick reminder, again, this is a mature show. There are heads that can get chopped off in that game. Hopefully not mine, but no guarantees. I turn this up to a higher difficulty um, than I normally play at. So I'll see what happens, and I'm doing it with a new character. Now I'm going to take down that info. I'm going to throw up something else for you here. Um, so this is not quite vanilla Skyrim. It's still close enough. So those are the mods that I'm currently running. Uh, Sky UI will be the one that's the biggest change just because when I go into the inventory, I thought it, it's a much nicer system than what's already there. The other stuff, um, some sound, some cosmetic stuff, uh, not a big game changer. I mean, some people have really modded the look of this game, and uh, I haven't gone terribly far in that regards. So, you know, that stuff's not going to interfere too much. Again, one reminder, you got less than a year to go. QuestCon down in Mobile, Alabama, October 20th through 22nd. Uh, there's your QuestCon code to get a discount at the checkout. Just mention my name. Without much further ado, we're going to get into the game here. Make sure I got my other stuff. Again, death count zero. It's been a while since I've... Uh, played something that I didn't already have something on the death count. So, let's kick the game into gear here. I've had it running uh, silently in the background. Alright, and there you can see I am level one. Yep, this is very early on in the game. We're getting kind of near the end of the uh, of where you get into the game. And I'm going to back out here, show you who I'm playing. Actually, let me put my weapons away for a moment, or it won't let me pan around. I am playing an orc. Yeah, yeah, look at that. He's pretty ugly. I actually intended this guy to be more of a two-hander, yet sneaky. He's actually wearing imperial armor because, if you haven't played the, uh, the first part, that's all that you have, either grabbing the storm cloak armor like this guy has or the imperial armors. This is what I thought, even back when, I thought these are great graphics in this game. As you look at all this stuff going on here, the mist, the northern lights looks good, and there's been a lot of uh, mods to make this even better. Hold up! There's a bear just ahead. See her? I'd rather not tangle with her right now. <laughs> Let's try to sneak by. Just take it nice and slow, and watch where you step. Or if you're feeling lucky, you can take this bow. Might take her by <laughs> surprise. I think we're definitely going to start off with action and start with that bear. Um, let's see. Actually, yeah, we already got that as number three. So this is something where I can kind of set up a few things. I have... Hey, Osiris. Welcome to the show. About to watch me kill my first bar. <laughs> Hopefully. We'll see. 
sneaking is overrated, eh? Whoop. Get my weapon out, get my weapon out. There we go. First bear down. First opponent down. I get my arrow back and get my pelt. Oh, and I did mention it yet in the show, but I do have the difficulty turned up a bit. Doing special edition. Uh, no, this is not the special edition one, unfortunately. That's still the old. I do have some mods going, which, uh, let me remind you, I don't have that on the screen right now. Uh, Sky UI is the big one, and actually I'll show you the results of that. So this is the inventory screen off of Sky UI, and I got that off the Nexus mods. I thought this was a lot more organized than the default uh, menus. You can see here. easier to just kind of navigate and use. Uh, they still got where you've got the old style here, magic. You really start off with just a few things, you know, some offensive flames and some healing. I should actually put that healing on my bar somewhere here. Uh, seven. There we go. Yep. So again, that's. Uh, let me just. I suppose just give you the where you can see it again. So that's currently the mods I'm running. A lot of them still aren't going to be a big difference in Skyrim here. I figured that Sky UI, that inventory, is the biggest one. Otherwise, armors. I don't see a big difference. Although definitely the female armors are more feminine. Meets their shape better. Uh, sounds of Skyrim, so the sounds you're hearing in this dungeon is also a mod. And realistic ragdolls enforced because, I uh, have to admit, uh, some of the way uh, Skyrim would like throw around a character, it's kind of odd. Alright. I can't remember if there was something up here where the bear originally was or not. So we're right near the start of the game. Like I say, this is still level 1 character. And we're escaping a prisoner situation you find yourself in right at the start of the game. And we're almost out of the cave. When we do go out of the cave, I'm not going to follow the standard uh, path. That, that looks like the way out. I knew we'd make it. There we go. And you see there's a doorway out, that symbol there. Correct. Uh, so... For YouTubers later, Kay Fragel's asking, so the last one affects character and NPC physics. Uh, correct. Some of the... Oh, yeah, that, that is how you can pickpocket somebody, too. If you get stealth and you there get behind goes. them... Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to this know person if can't be pickpocketed. <laughs> it never hurts you to look, but Clear it's when you here. try to grab something that's different. My sister, Gerder. Runs the mill in Riverwood. So yeah, road. some of the NPC physics were help you out. quite exaggerated. Best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. All right. Let's go up here a sec. I see something I want to see from a larger view. All right. So we are in Skyrim. Very northern part of the Elder Scroll series. There goes Rayloff off to, you know, bye bye. Okay. Uh, what was that? The Horn of the, the Spine of the. And I can't remember the name of that mountain. Just about anywhere on the map, you can see that mountain. And that is a long way to get there. The journey up that mountain is said to be 7,000 steps. And the people who made the game says it actually does take about 7,000 steps to walk up there. Same with the Malice stealth. They always seem to detect me before I get to them. Okay. Well, one thing I did figure out, or that people show you with stealth, is you could probably stealth in a town somewhere and go AFK, and you can skill that up. Pickpocketing, yeah. I think the best way is there is a person in the Thieves Guild. You can, every level, you can buy five trainings from somebody. So you don't have to actually use them in the wild. You can buy them. Um... And there was a person who did pickpocketing. I think that's where I upgraded some most of mine. 
As far as other skills in Skyrim, for those who aren't familiar with the game, um, yeah, they're gained by using. Your armor is upgraded by taking hits. Your weapons are upgraded by delivering hits. Oh, uh, little fox. I ain't going to mess with the little fox right now. So let's take a look. You got maps all over. Uh, and we are not going to follow the main quest. The main quest is to go down that direction, and there is a town called, I think that's Riverwood down there. Um, okay. Oh, yeah. So Riverwood's already on the map. This is where I'm, oh, I'm, a, I'm not even aiming at the spine. Sorry, I'm even looking at the wrong mountain. That's funny. I'm looking over there, and I'm looking at the, trying to talk about how big the mountain is. I'm looking at the wrong mountain. There it is. Not that I can get a good look at it here. That mountain. <laughs> yeah, that, that's much more impressive when I look at the right mountain compared to that one. And that one. <laughs> Sliding down the hill here. Okay. So anyways, the thing is, we're supposed to go to a town that's up that river, and that is Riverwood. But we're not going to do that. We're going to get, I'm going to go off into the woods around the lake here, and we're just going to kind of find trouble. So I'm living off the land, so to speak. Now originally, I wanted to make this, uh, my main character in this game is Thamon, a ranger. Human ranger, just like, has always been my favorite character. This guy here... Maybe I should get a look at him without the armor. This is also much easier with this mod. Okay, so I gotta put the weapons away in order to actually pan around the character. So there's my there's my ugly orc. And his war paint. Ergosk always has war paint. This is actually a character in a book that I'm writing. A series of books and I just he kind of fit the type of character I was going for here now one nice thing we got is a guardian stone here you find these places we'll learn all magic and yeah, you know I'll do it he's not gonna be a mage oh sorry there we go that's a hot orc if we find another one of these, I'll grab something else because I don't really intend to raise this guy with uh, magic. And there's a hut over there and a hunter camp down here. I think we'll go over that hut in a moment. I remember there was trouble there before, so we're going to see. Oh, run a sword board orc on my special gen. Yep. And right now, I wanted to do this guy two-hander. I just haven't ran across a two-hander. You know, you're mostly escaping from... That now look at that. The the game knows if you're trying to steal stuff. Longing to say that person right there. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. It's not like my poach. Take a look. Oh cool. I can sell to somebody. I've I figured being off in the wild I wasn't gonna see as much. Now his he's only got eight gold. I don't know if y'all can see it with my UI, it's down and he's only got eight gold. So I guess I will not be selling after all. Maybe he's got He's got nothing I can buy either. Never mind. Until next time. Yep, until next time. It's enough for all of us if you aren't greedy. Oh, this orc is greedy. But I'll let you live. <laughs> Let's go see if I can stir up some trouble up here. If I re recall, there's places up here around this hut to where I'd ran into action before. Whoa! Yep. Now I am on master. There you go. I'm on master, so this game is less forgiving if I screw up. Whoa, look at that. And you can do special moves. Wow. Okay. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I drank a potion by accident. I meant to use this here, uh, heal. Limited heal you have at the start of the game.
Whoops, what happened? Oh, that's right. Shields are over here. Sorry. But that was a surprise. I'll take the wool pelts. I might still find a space to sell later. <laughs> Goes the wolf. Yeah, like I say, th this game will see. But look at look at the graphics on this. Now, people rated it with high graphics before. Other people hated these graphics. And yet, there are people that have released mods out there that have better graphics with less uh, processing. You know, we might be able to poke up there later. That's actually part of a quest, but you can enter locations even if you don't uh, have the quest. You can mess around. Let's see. Oh, yeah, there's somebody. All right. Oh, and say hi. I'm just a poor old woman, dear. No need to trouble yourself with me. Oh, uh, maybe. It's so nice to have a visitor. Okay. So she... It's bugs. tough just scraping sure. by out here, but I make do. And for those who later watch on YouTube, I'm also watching the comments in the live it's show. It's so nice to have a visitor. Okay. Now, there's all sorts of nice things you can do. Now, I know this lady is actually a troublemaker. So, I am going to outright steal some stuff here. Why not? She's right there. Oh, maybe she won't even see me. N NPCs can react. Oh, drink. Never should have come here. Whoa! Yep. Oh, hello. Yep, yep, health is low, I know, I know. Look, my one hand had increased. Look, where is she? Whoa! Okay. Pause. That's another quick way to slam a potion. There we go. <laughs> oh, she, I think she's going to have me. <laughs> Her and the wolf. <laughs> First death. Well, I turned up to master, and she's no small fry. Where to put me? All oh, back here. Wait. Oh, where the dragon leaves. <laughs> death one. Yep. Let's get on the death count. I figured, I, you know, it's... Chances of dying are much larger right now because of, like I say, I, I'm used to playing this game, but up to difficulty, low-level character, I don't even have the weapons I want to work on. Um, which... Mm, Which is, uh, which is toast. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I normally run it a debt, which is, I, I don't even know how to say that word properly. Never mock a person that mispronounces a word because they learned it by reading. But adept, there he goes. I try to do the P Looks and the like T. And, uh, anyways. Time. That seems to be the normal setting. Let's go a different direction. Let's go right over the hill. I am clearing out of here. Bye bye. I'm going this way. If I recall, there is another camp on the other side of uh, one of the hills here, but it might be three people at that camp if they're around. They're not always. <laughs> Mean old lady one, Hammond zero. Yeah, if you need to get on TeamSpeak, tell people I'm on a high difficulty and I've already gotten toasted. <laughs> by the way, welcome everyone else out here. Okay, elk, let's go hunting by. Oh, wait a minute, I got that bow. Where's that bow? Two? No. Three? Try to be sneaky about it. Uh-oh. 
Okay. <laughs> a far cry from my ranger and his glass steel arrows and such. And now I've just got this guy and his iron arrows, and there it goes. I'm going to have to catch him. Oh, I forgot. I can rage. That would have been helpful to remember in that fight. I can rage. That's, oh, there's the camp. There's the camp I was talking about. Oh, and bees. You see these bees? You see and hear these bees? There are honeybee nests around that are worth are worth something to the right person. Caught a bee. <laughs> bee added. Look at that. There, there it is. So those honey, those hives are worth something to the right person. Ooh, somebody got a rabbit. Food will nourish you too. Tomato, one point of health. I'd rather use the spell. Let's see. Oh, all right. Using the mouse to position the lock pick. And then just a right or left key to try to open the lock and see if you do it. Potion miner stamina and scroll worth money. Okay. Here they come. They're looking for me. Oh, now they see me. Where are you? Who got me? Who got me? Okay, trouble. Now you'll see me rage. Orc rage. Orc stuck on something. Where are you? Yeah. Oop, I didn't mean to have the healing thing up. Let me grab my shield. The nice thing about uh, Elder Scrolls by Skyrim is you can you can stop the action to correct a wrong and like jam a potion down your throat, like this one. I'm gonna put you down. Oop, I'm still crouched. That's funny. I'm still. Whoa! There we go. Special hit. B caught another B in the middle of that. All right. Hunting bow, iron dagger, armor, gold. I can carry a lot of stuff. Typically, I'm just grabbing stuff that I can like turn. Oh, and a trap. Look at that. There are traps laying around some of these too, and as you can see, I just missed stepping on one. <laughs> there we go. Ergosk is still in a rage here. He's still got that cooked beef. Ten points of health. I'll take it. I promised before, it's harder to tell this thing to ready a shield in the offhand. You kind of have to dive into the menu for that. Uh, for bracers, high boots, more arrows, lockpick. All right. Cool. So there's the camp of three people that I remember could be a problem before. Um, rabbits, food. Oh, there we go. Healing, high boots worth something. Read the refugees. Oh, okay. And, you, and a reminder, too, if you're interested in this game, you find books all over the world that also can give you a uh, stat boost of some kind. You don't have to necessarily take the book the moment you read it the first time. Oh, arrows. Like reclaim. No, I didn't mean to use the tanning rack. <laughs> all right. Well, okay, now that we survived that time to find more fun. The thing is, I used up the Orc Rage, so that's not coming back for 24 hours, I believe. 
So where are we? So remember he told us Riverwood. I went up by the lake earlier. Uh, Falkreath Town's down here. I don't know how my character knew about Falkreath. There's a lot of stuff that doesn't appear on the map unless you get close. But if you look on the radar, I don't know if you can see it. Again, on the top of my screen, like when I look around, I can see if there's other things. I'm looking at that now. Oh, another deer. Do some running. Somebody's hot. Who size that elk? All right, I'm gonna try to go elk hunting with an axe, and uh, there is a low-level fire spell that you get. Here we go. There we go. An axe and a flame spell. I can hunt with that better than a uh, better than a bow. Ah! Come back here. There we Hello. Skeever. <laughs> Which is basically like some rat. Hey, level level two off a rat. Oh my gosh, it's EverQuest all over again. <laughs> you can grab ingredients off these things too for uh, potion making and such, which I'm not going to mess with in the show. Cool, I leveled up. Oh, ooh, look at this guy. Yeah. Alright, I suppose I should do the level up next. Um, let's do health. You can increase health, magic, stamina. There's no way I'm really doing spells here, so. Block. Or one handed. You know what? I really want to get better at sneak, though. So, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go into sneak. There we go. And you learn more tricks the farther up that thing you go. Now let's see if anyone's home. Oh, uh, you gotta unlock the door. That's usually a sign more of uh, bad people in here. Maybe actually a small dungeon. There we go. We want it. Oh. We're not doing a death account for picks, okay? Oh, don't. I swear I thought it was. There we go. Oh, I should save. I should save before I walked in the door. Drop to a crouch and save. Gargosk, Gargosk. There we go. There's, yeah, you, the, uh, that other save there was uh, my main character, Thamon. By the way, if things go well, maybe. Sunday, get myself an island. Did you hear that? Tire someday, get myself an island. Now, typically, the bracers, what am I wearing right now? Well, right now I'm wearing a bunch of heavy armor. Go cheese wheel. Take it. Drinks. Take it. Ooh, potion. Cool. Uh, might pay off my bounty this time. 
might pay off my bounty this time. So let's get. You know, let's forget the shield. I think I will go with the uh, flames and sword. That's a nice combo. Hey, Greed. Welcome. You, you already missed a rather uh, uh, little old lady beat me up right out of the gate. You missed that one. But we've done better since. <coughs> Oops. Should be a blown stealth right there. Knock the broomstick down. What was that? Oh. What are you swinging at? Oh, he's gonna hit me. Oh, that didn't end well for him. I had braces and a big. Ooh, is that two hander? I gotta check it out. That looked like it was two hander. I originally wanted this guy to do big two-handed ones. That mean old he's coming for a broom. <laughs> oh, let's see. So that war axe, you know, weight 11, damage 9. It's war hammer. Damage 22. Much more damage, less weight. You know what? I'm going to turn this into a new favorite. I'm going to grab this thing. Now let's see. So Steel War Hammer. I don't have a 1 anymore, do I? Alright, you're number 1. Look at that. Yeah. Now we're ready to get the two-handed on. So Creed is also at a higher difficulty as evidenced by me being beaten up by a little old lady right off the bat. Uh, ho! Look at that. There we go. Let's, let's not push the button yet. But you can see that this, this game gives excellent clues. Things like air seeping under a door and such. What is this? Note to Rorlack. Time will keep breaking down this. <laughs> cool. Oh, look, more traps. More arrows. Hope I'm not making anyone dizzy. I'm mostly looking for uh, some potions and valuable stuff here. Alright, time to see what's down here. And you know, push the shiny button. We are famous last things, right? Ooh, yeah, look at that. Oops, I meant to steal. I don't want the bucket. <laughs> Where'd the bucket end up? Here. Drop. I'm going to drop the two bees. I don't need, you know, you can eat them. I'll show what you can do. You can eat them. Ooh, got stamina from it. Alright, let's go down. Still crouching, still sneaking. Yeah, still sneaking with really heavy armor on. Oh, Creed, this is an orc, by the way. I plan to do an orc two-hander. Hopefully, actually, rather sneaky, but uh, you know what? He's got, he's, he picked up heavy armor. I'm going with that. Okay. We got big chamber here. What the? Can't make out what's on the floor over there. Somebody over there. Ooh. Search high elf? Ugh. There we go. Stamina. Healing. So one thing I haven't done yet. I haven't assigned 
stamina potion. Not that I've had too many of them. Here we well, oh, yeah, yeah, um, yeah, it will create. You can go out here. And I can still, like, I've still got my aiming thing and such. Um, if I put my weapons away, I can look around. So you can play it in third person if you want. And, you know, helpful for, like, seeing stuff behind you. Now let's see, seven was the healing spell, so six will be this guy. I have to remember all this stuff now. <laughs> yeah, so, oh, two of them over there. All right, wait till the one walks away. Now I have a bow and arrow, which doesn't work worth a darn. Oh, he's looking back this way. So I think any attempted at stealth is going to really get blown, especially with two of them right there. So maybe we should just get out the bow. Three and then back to one. All right. Over here. Whoa. What you gonna do? Huh? What you gonna do? Ooh. Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Ooh. Teach that guy a lesson. So, what do we learn from this thing? It's slow. But when it hits, it's devastating. I also hope I can find a merchant somewhere they'll take. Oh, look where that one arrow hit him. Look right around the jaw. Light painted body shield. Armor 19. That might be better than the shield I got. Let me see. You got to check for a moment. Now, nobody else is coming. Still attacking. Yeah, that is fun though too. It's like you can see the arrows on him for a while afterward. Um, uh, not that much better. The iron shield still better, but a lot heavier. Right now, weight's not an issue, but yeah, look at that. Uh-oh. Got more bodies? Oh, I thought I heard someone moving. It's the banner waving up there. Whoa! Oh, that's not what I meant. Sorry. Oh! Oh, look at that again. Oh. That 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 is truly the orc style, I guess. Wow. Ooh, ring. I shield for a bracer. Ooh, cheese. No, oh, that that cheese wedge is not too much. Man. And for those who missed it, I'm just using a basic heal that you start the game with. Wow, that's interesting. All right, let's pop open some doors here. Barred from the other side. Okay. How about this one? Oop, got a mock. Ah! Like I said, we will not have a death count for lock picks. Oh, not quite. Let's see. And I say this, uh, since Creep joined the channel, see what I said earlier. This, oh! Okay, I think I'm almost right on straight up and down. There we go. Ooh, look at that. Take that, I'll take that. Frostbite, venom. That's worth some. And wine. 
There we go. We need to drink the wine. Just because it goes with this character. There we go. Yeah, worth it. As long as I don't immediately rush into a fight. So we've got there, here, there. That last guy came from over here, so that's what we're going to check out. Right back. What is that? What are these statues? Huh, okay. Nothing there. Now, hopefully it won't get me killed later in this game, but one thing that throws me off with this is so many games, especially first-person shooters, used to using the shift to run. In this game, if you push shift, you go slow. You walk. That has gotten me killed in Skyrim before. Okay. Let's go down here. I thought I saw some bodies or something over here earlier. Whoa! What was that? Trap. <laughs> Ouch. Bear trap. Lucky that thing wasn't dead layer. I gotta look at the floor more because it's not like those things are hidden. you look around, like, activate lever. Okay, I have a bad memory. Ooh. Yeah, I have a bad memory about this, and I don't remember exactly what it was. I'm going to get close enough to search without stepping on that thing. Uh... Yeah, yeah, look at that. Ooh. I can even see a coin pouch out there, but I ain't going down there. Oh, wait. Then there's a lever here. What does this lever do? Hmm. This game has a set of puzzles. Yeah, let Damon go first in games with trap. Oh, don't you know? Like, see, I'm normally the ranger. The motto is, Rangers lead, clerics follow closely behind. Aha! There we go. I'm getting better at this. That is a trap, too. What the heck activates it? Um... When you eventually get that little Fus Roda thing, you can set off a lot of traps by. I swear I don't like the look of this hall. It's like I almost want to find out, and I almost don't want to find out. Okay. Alright. I still need to watch my step because I think just touching the spikes will still do stuff to me. There we go, coin purse. And I don't remember who I searched and who I didn't. They've still got gold. Maybe this only activates like a one-way trap. It's a trap. <laughs> cool. Oh, there we go. Now, I've only got 11 lockpicks left. Ah. 
There we go. Yeah, oh, look at that. Amethyst gold. Lockpick. There. there we go. Yeah. I think there was still one little area up here I didn't go to, so I'm going to check that out. Ten. Ten what? Am I playing a perfect ten? Man, look at the mist here and everything. Again, a reminder, the sound in this dungeon is modded. Uh, it still sounds very similar to what they originally had, but can somebody... Looking for other people, of course. Uh-oh. Whoa, okay. First one around the corner is going to get a hammer upside the head. Oh, it. I swear I'll kill you. Go ahead. Try and fight. Okay, we are in trouble. Yeah. Health is low, I know. <laughs> but you've leveled up. You're about dead, but you've leveled up. <laughs> Throw a grenade. Oh, wrong game. Okay, well, the game paused it on me, but this is serious. Uh-oh, did he just get me? All right. Uh, this, this is the funny part. <coughs> Beef. <coughs> Jeez. Forget the wine. Or actually, yeah, I need wine, don't I? <laughs> Probably drunk now. <laughs> and healing. One more. All right. Now, fight! Now that I've got my second win. Ooh, there. Hey, 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 look. It's another orc with a two-handed maul. Oh, wow. You call me kid. Oh, there you go. <laughs> that brought out the headbutt. Puny weakling. <laughs> wow. Whew. That's yeah, serious. Man. Search bandit. More arrows. I see, I'm not picking up everything because I've been avoiding the only known town so far. So, just been grabbing a bunch of... Oh, my God. <laughs> Whew, okay. So, let's level up. Now that I've got a two-hander, that's what I'm going to level up. We're, there's two-handed over here. Oh, magic health or stamina? Well, let's go a little stamina, too. Need one with this thing. There you go. Two-handed weapons do 20% more damage. Yes. They're already pretty damaging when I slam these guys head, head on. Oh, look. All right. Um... I don't think I can technically use this yet. We'll see. Uh, yeah, I need iron or steel. So in the game, you can get into the skills, too, to upgrade your weapons. Upgrade them like a smith. Upgrade them with magic. You can really take your character any direction. Whatever magic you want to concentrate on, whatever weapon style you want to concentrate on, you can truly make a character that fits your style. Potion of Brief Invisibility. We'll remember that the next time three guys charge at me. Now, the only sad thing is, this is the only Elder Scrolls game I've played. I haven't played any of the older ones. Uh, let me get the mall out here. I've peeked deeper into the dungeon and found a stairway. Let's see. Oh, yeah. There we go. And I haven't been as careful as I should have been. 
you can even see if there's a trap on a chest sometimes uh, a string coming out from it or something like that oh um, oops oh, oh another one I go through so many picks Yay. linen wrap no thanks we don't need uh, mummy wrap now I'm curious as to what's down here and I'm going up this way because there could be more bear traps and so what was that? oh hello where's my bow where's my bow that's not my bow. I'll kill you as soon as I find out what I did with my bow. Can't wait to count out your coin. So she got an arrow in her neck. Try to go for the healing. Shoot, when did I last save? Much more went. So where was I? Okay, so it automatically saved after I hit that level thing. Thank goodness. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have to do the death count, I know. And it's like, dang it. I was reaching for that potion too. I am interested in the other Elder Scrolls. Now, keep in mind, I never finished Skyrim. Uh, there's the Dragonborn quest. There's the Civil War. Those are the two big quests. And then a ton of smaller ones. And I, I've i mostly been avoiding those big quests. I haven't participated in the Civil War at all. You know, someday. And uh, the Dragonborn one, I've gone partway along that. But I think still a lot to go. Okay, so... Death count two. Um, I don't know. Uh, oh. Second death by a lady. <laughs> Not quite a lady. I thought that she was no lady. Anyway. But, you know. Crazy preparing. But, you know, this is Ergosk. You know, big barbarian warrior. Right, let's save over that. So I want to. I'm still gonna go back up here and grab what was in that chest. I'm gonna be more sneaky now. See a trend here. Yeah, yeah the ladies are all beating me up tonight. There we go. Notice I'm very careful with the lock pick as well. Um, she was there, right? I'm having trouble actually visualizing her, but I know she's right there. Okay. Let's get out the bow again. The actual bow this time. Got tons of iron arrows. Oh yeah, there she is. Okay, she may have detected me. I'll kill you if I have to. Well, get up here. Oops. Oops. Healing. I meant that to be the fire. Switch, 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 switch. Where am I going? There we go. Get out the war hammer. And get off my knee. Still. There we go. Let's see. 
Yep, let's get some healing potions in me. She can hit. Came off, game on. There we go. Oh! Ooh. That, yes, that was the way that played. Whoa. I think I have brains on my shoes. Oh, man. All right. Um, you know, I should have tried to fight one of these by third person sometime. You know, just for Creed wants, but... Man, okay. There, yeah. That's what save games are for. Come back and get you. Gold. I found my arrow. Um, let's see. Oh, lock pick. Going with that. Whew. <laughs> One sweet revenge. Oh, thanks, folks. Are we halfway through the show? Let's see. All right, so I'm going to position myself here. I just saved. Um, I'm only temporary pausing because i got to say something. Team speak here. Got to do a little advertising. So, folks, thanks for joining me. Now, so heads up. So today is the 17th, um, and I've been looking in the future. I've been realizing something. I do this every other Saturday night. The next one is New Year's Eve. I work. The next two weeks is a company get-together. And I know that sometime in February there's something going on too. So actually, more likely, I'm going to check. I might switch my weekends so that January 7th and then every other weekend I'm going to go from there. So, again, keep uh, keep checking Grievance. Uh, Grievance is Facebook. I put it up earlier. I'll put it up again later. There we go. Had to just kind of get something in the uh, team speak there, too. So what we're going to do here is we'll go a little farther with our Gosk. When we get close to the end of the show, here's my treat. I'm going to keep the, uh, well, I don't know if I'll keep the difficulty setting where it is, but I'm going to take my 39-level Ranger, and I'm going to go after a giant camp. So I might drop the difficulty back down, but you know, because I've never actually done that taken on a, not successfully, taken on a barbarian camp. Let's get the bow back out. Pinewash Bandit's Sanctuary. Huh. Hey, Shaka Khan. Yep, welcome to old Skyrim. Like I say, someday I'll take my main character and I make... Oh, look. See those traps? Those hanging bones there. If you brush into those, they will alert enemies too. And even though I'm sneaking around, Shotgun, if you missed it, I'm sneaking around as an orc in heavy armor. In other words, not too successfully. I get close enough, though, I can disarm these. Or at least it's supposed to give me the option to disarm them. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna avoid them. What was that? Uh oh. Oh, Ben. Oh, this is gonna hurt. No, no, no. We are getting rid of the. Ooh. Wow. They are shooting through my health. Let's get Potion of Strength. Uh, I probably don't need to worry about Potion of Strength. I'm slamming through these guys whenever I... Yeah, we took out the chick first. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Potion of Brief Invisibility. I think i got to do that. I've got no health left. Unless... Uh, there we go. Let's move. Let's move. I've got no health left. Except for my... This. Oh, now they can see me. Now, that one's an arch. Okay, I know, I know. Yeah, yeah, we don't need that. Just a scratch. Yeah, they just about got me. The archer's gonna give me problems here. We may have another death coming up. Unless I run through the door. 
Better part of valor, run through the door. Got you. Okay, Archer. Here, Archer, Archer, Archer. We are hovering at that, just about to die. Oh no, here he comes. I'm not trying to hide from you. You know where you're lying. Yeah, like I said. Thank goodness for very basic heals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, if I'm dead, come kill me. All right. Oops, stuck on a wall. <laughs> Give me enough time. I'm going to totally heal up. Yeah, you missed. You see that? Going over the barrels. Over the tripping on the barrels. Where are you hiding? Where are you hiding? There you are. Oh, he's trying to. I think you barely missed. Charge! Oh, yeah. Big hammer strike. Ooh. Oh, oh, wow. Yep, yep, we were so close to a death there. Man. So th this is a master difficulty cooked beef. I could use it. So this is tougher than I Roar's letter? All right, let's check out Roar's letter. Whew. Uh, here we go. I mean, apparently, but she's as dumb as a man with body hair like one, too. <laughs> you may head north, catch a ship. I know a guy whose cousin knows a guy that could. Wow. Oh, man. All right. Let's finish looting everybody. Oh, did I stash? What do you want to bet? I stepped at that at some point during that fight to... What did happen to Gallows? Oh, unlock expert. I might lose all my remaining lockpicks trying to do this one. I, I barely tap the right left because I'm trying not to break the picks. See if I get in the right area here. Oops. Right there. Almost. It's a very thin line that's... Ooh. Dang. Eh. I think I lost. Let's see. Seven lockpicks left. Yay! Soul gem. Okay. When you have magic items in this game... Soul gem, they they lose, they lose their magic the more you use them. You can trap stuff in soul gems, and soul gems will power them back up. The, the game's very got a very nice system for balancing magic, balancing stamina. That's kind of why I've been so slow with the main quests, even on my main character, because I don't want the game to end. You know, I just want to keep going. Um, okay, nothing there. Nothing there. Making sure I'm not missing any other treasures. Nord Mead. There's also probably all sorts of food in it. There's. Oop. Boop. Took an arrow. Souvenir. Yeah, see that mess? Search Bandit, more ale, gold, lockpick. Already seen Roar's letter. All right, Bandit, gold. Take the boots. All of them had Roar's letter. Ooh. So what do you all think so far? Oh, look at that! I'm just about into the next level. 
Actually, I better know how I can do it, too. Oh, no, I'm already healed. Sorry. Now, I came from here. Yay, I remember our fight, too. There we go. Cleared out the dungeon, you know, I wasn't even expecting, I thought it'd be even more for outside fights, but look at this. You know, we never figured out this one door. Where am I now? Okay. There's this one door that's barred from the other side. So we didn't find, yeah, we didn't find the uh, trick to that one. Probably pops up in town somewhere or something. Oh, and for those who care, you can grab stuff and pick it up even... Okay, I, I'm a little too heavily loaded for that. But you can pick up stuff and just fling it, throw it, rearrange. Activate bear trap. No, let's get out of here. Whew. All right, now I get out of here and we find our way to the next challenge. Or find a way to town. There's one there. Oh, oh, another button. Now there's no guarantee. Oh, what's this? Read warning. That's interesting. My children, but Roars didn't think was. I don't remember this note being on the uh, pinned on the door when I came in here. Not that I was really looking for it. Wow. Yeah, who knows? Okay, save before I go out the door. Yeah, Ergosk has been a barbarian rogue in a campaign that I played here. Locally. What is walking down the road over there? The heck was that? Knight, look at that. Look at that sky. You can even see constellations up there. Um, where's my line of thought? So Ergosk has been a barbarian rogue in a home campaign. And those who know, you know, I write books. And he's got a, a big part coming up in a series that's coming up too. Oh, look at that. Okay, that's usually trouble. Let's go slightly around it. Where's town? Town is down that way. Yeah, writing a Pilgrims of Blade series. Um, I've planned on writing it like a collection of shorter stories. Kind of like the way actually Conan was originally... Oh, level up. Oh, it's, I, that's right. I did level up. I got hit that. It's going to have these five people. Ergos going to be one of them. Let's go back to more health. We've had too many close calls. Block. Oh, with a shield or weapon. Let's let's dive into that one too. Get a little basic for ourselves, actually. Okay. I will. All right, yeah. Let me put my uh, website. Oops. Put my website up in the chat room here. Just as long as y'all realize this is this is mine, not grievance. I do this for grievance, to, so don't blame them as far as if you don't like my books. <laughs> okay. So that's my website. Uh, there's links there which will take you to my books, to Kindle. There's also links which will take you to past Swords Drawn Guns Loaded shows. You know, uh, I appreciate when I get the views and the likes on the show. Whoa! 
Someone shoot at me. <laughs> I was like, clunk. What was that? Clunk. There's a guy over there shooting at me. Oh, dude. First guy's right here. You'll be so much easier to rob when you're dead. Ooh. There you go. Okay. Now where's your buddy? Oh, there's your buddy. I'm trying to get a little stamina back here. Just give up. Serpentine, serpentine, serpentine. I want seed cars. <laughs> Ouch! You got me with the, your iron arrows. Don't do any worse than mine do. That hardly hurt. Come here. Come here. I'm trying to rush him, and it's not letting me. Oh, I'm crouching still. Dang it. Oh, yeah. Oh. There we go. Don't die. Still, that was funny. It's like clatter of a arrow, and I felt like an NPC. What was that? I see the second one. <laughs> oh, lockpick, Nordmead. There you go. It's a character thing. I have to take the mead. Anyways, I knew that was going to happen. Whenever you have this set up, you usually got bandits over the over the road. Don't you guys got a treasure chest somewhere to make this all worthwhile? Where's the treasure? Sometimes they have more stuff. Uh, if you haven't played Skyrim before, let me tell you. Oh, there it is. See, take a look right there. Trap. How do they set it off, though? Where's the... I don't see the switch to set off the trap. There's a, there's a trap right here where you're, they roll these boulders and drop them on you. I just don't see the switch. Everything here has a, a proper switch. So there are all sorts of uh, surprises that the game can pull on you and traps. See, where's this guy? Here you go. Got to take your gold. Oh, iron ingot. There we go. I could actually uh, cook beef. There we are. This is worth something. Falk wreath isn't that far. I think I'll take it with me. Whoa! And then right after I said it... <laughs> there, see? I I meant to... Uh, yeah. <laughs> I meant to do a hands-on demonstration so that y'all could see. <laughs> okay, so it wasn't a release lever up there. It was something down here that, you tri that I tripped. <laughs> Oh, okay. Where was Falkreath again? Somewhere up into the left. Alright, so, still gonna try to get to town here. Oh, there's some kind of keep up here. Uh, this rocks. Let's get the bow out. Not that I do much with it. It's just nice to be able to hit somebody with the bow a little bit. Get, uh, there's lots of stuff in this game. Peak Shade Tower. You can harvest stuff. You can use for alchemy and all that. I'm right on the thing now, so I might as well get the hammer out. Detect. Whoa! Spriggan. Run. Run away. Run away. Spriggans are tough.
Is it still chasing me? I'm gonna raise my magic as soon just for all the heals. Okay, so that was a Spriggan. That was a nature creature. And they are very tough. <laughs> Whew. Horse? Okay, let's go check it out. I'm so eager to throw myself back into, you know, dangerous way. Man on a horse, see what happens. Noble? Oh, a noble and a guard, so. Can't get to ready to talk to him. I have nothing to say to you. Now move along, or I'll order my guards to attack. You'll order your guards to I see one guard. So I will bring up a note of point. If you want to live like a road, you can. You know, if I smack this guy and it's witnessed, there'll be a bounty on my head in this territory of Skyrim. Doesn't matter anywhere else. Uh, but then if I get the last witness, then the bounty goes away. Which is really tempting with the haughty noble on the road. Yeah. Yeah. Here. Save. Here, watch. While they're doing this, I'm just going to go sneaking. Sneak. I'm going to wait till. See, it costs nothing to look. Steel arrows. 53% to steal. An imperial bow. Much nicer than the one I got. 10% to steal. Yeah, he'll notice it. Out of interest, let's try to steal some steel arrows. You have committed crimes against Skyrim yep. and her people. What say you in your defense? Uh, you caught me up. Uh, I'd rather die than go to prison. Someone do something. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Bounty, unless I get the guy that saw it happen. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, horse. Uh-oh. Okay. Oh, I got the horse on me. The horse is going to kill me. Now, I typically do not endorse charging, but I was doing that to show some everyone what could happen to you. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Are you coming at me again? Oh! Of course, I really want a better relationship between the two of us. I want to ride you off in the sun. The horse is going to kick my butt. Oh, gee. I didn't even notice if the bounty went away with me getting the noble. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. A horse. <laughs> uh, that that is like you you is like you're really gonna try this. This is just asking for the worst possible karma here. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think normally the horse would have reacted like that, except I accidentally hit the horse during the fight. Yeah. Eh, I, Urgos totally deserved that karma. Not me, Urgos. He did it. That's funny. Uh, death by horse. Uh. No, not say that. Not say that. Not say. Uh, 
caused a horse pop. Oh my gosh, no. That's got to rank around one of the most embarrassing things. <laughs> okay, so for the YouTube crowd later, Osiris says in chat, no animals were harmed in the making of correction. Damon was harmed by a horse in the making of this. <laughs> Oops. Okay. So, <laughs> we know what would happen. Wow. So, we know what would happen. You, someday, I'm going to be higher level. I'm going to come back. And we're going to have a reckoning. All right. I'm going to go to town. There's Falkreath. So it was mostly in the wilderness, but let's unload some stuff. Let's take the uh, take the fast way down the hill. Put the weapon away. Let's see if he talks about Just air. my luck. Stuck in the sticks with this crazy old woman. That's some fine imperial armor you've got there. Oh, well, yeah, he is. I am wearing Imperial armor. Let me guess. <laughs> Someone stole your sweet roll. Actually, I've been stealing everybody else's. Little K Fraggle. Horse 1, Damon 0. Was it a chick horse? I, deal with petty and drunken brawls. I, I didn't. Too long since we've had a good bandit raid. Oh, trust me. I just tried a bandit raid up there a short while ago. I was going to say, I didn't get that good a look at... Oh, didn't mean to do that. Ooh, if the guards will go after you if they catch you picking a lock. Uh, here's the inn. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. Cool. Oh, level up. Uh, let's do just a little more health. We'll work on stamina later. And... Two-handed, archery, sneak, let's go back to uh, two-handed. Thought I clicked that one already. Now, I want that one eventually, a champion stance. We should just do what was up there. Uh, well, like I say, very soon I'll get on my high-level character. I'll pick a fight with a giant. And I will make sure from a distance... Uh, stop, stop singing, stop singing. What can I do for We don't want music that might that I might have to mute later on. Uh, what do you do? I'm a bard, here? trained at the bard's college in solitude. At some Wanderers point, like you should think about applying. She could just spend less time right. serving Dengue. Cool. Do you think I'd make a fine bar to attacking nobles and get stomped by their horse? Yeah, yeah, check it out. I need that outfit for all my followers. You don't look so good. Are you feeling all right? No, I got stopped by a horse. Uh, what have we got for sale? Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. <laughs> Uh, let's see, arms above the divider line. Belong to no, well, okay, now this is off. Look at this. Above the divider line belong to the vendor. Below the line belong to you. Except I'm using a different UI, so. Okay, so that's what she's got to sell, but I want to sell to her. She's only got 118 gold. Oh, she'll only buy, like, the food from me, but. Uh. How much gold do I have? Oh, I got a good amount of gold. I suppose, yeah, if I want something to chomp down real quick instead of uh, a potion, as, as funny as that is, if you can visualize it, I'm getting hit. <laughs> Better. There we go. Yep, let's buy some ground beef. Chicken <laughs> breast. <laughs> 
Okay. Uh, it, it, there's more of the stuff you can do. Rumors, look for work, get a room. But, you know, that's not brilliant. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is a good point. Well, Cyrus says you probably have rock joint or something, but they keep asking if you're feeling all right. Is you, there any juicy gossip you in town? Can get, sure to share it with me. You can get diseased oh, in this game. Let's take a look. Magic. Um... Destruction. Towers, Berserker Rage. Reduced. Oh, Brain Rot! I should have noticed that when I just leveled, I saw my uh, mana was not Brain Rot. Well, that explains how come he got attacked and killed by a horse. <laughs> oh. So how do you get rid of the brain run? Okay, uh, certain temples you can do the altar and get it cured. Where else? I, I remember certain idols. You, know, you, you should lay down. <laughs> oh, playing video games has rotted my brain. Go figure. <laughs> Was a hero I don't hurt. I, you know, I don't think I hurt. Let's see. Yep. I'll rent a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. He's going to show me to my room. Oh, get dirty mind. Ooh, do I get the big one? Let me know if there's anything else you need. Ooh, I got the big one. Yay. Read. Nords arise. Okay. Now I think it's high time that you lie down and Look at this. They give you this chest and stuff. So it's all steel. All right. Slashy. Let's sleep. Rest for how long? Even a small amount of time, but let's just do the... Uh... Oh, it's morning. Uh, short rest. Altars are cheapest and easiest. Yep. Steel as the brave last Matilda charged in Next thing I got to look at is... Oh. I gotta talk to Nari just because I love her outfit. <laughs> oh, it's okay. She just said that. Ooh, look at the elves here. Personally, I think my orc is prettier. I think. Huh? Yep. Alright. See, look at that. There's a game where NPCs actually go in and out the door, too. So that's the question. Is there an altar in Falkreath? Hmm. I'm trying to think of the location. There's the smithy, all the stuff. You can create your weapons and all that. There might be one in the Lord's house. Uh, let's see. It's an apothecary. That's a barracks, I think. Let's go in the Lord's house. Maybe I'll get lucky there. Your Yarl. The Yarl. Closest one is White Run. Yeah, I'm kind of worried about that too. Like, I can remember that one. There's the Yarl. They all look bored like that, I think, when you first run into them. Oh, hello. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I am an Imperial. Show me the whole map. Show, show us what us, uh, nice Imperials are doing. <laughs> oh, look at those potions right there. See, I am nice. Ergosk is not nice. He's like, whoa, that's worth something. Let's talk to this guy. Let's see what he says. Believe Damn Stormcloak rebels. How does one join? How's the... Think you've got the medal, eh? Honestly, the well, Legion can use all the able bodies it can muster. Yes, don't they ask where I got this armor I'm wearing. A dead king, a rebellion, and now dragons. Skyrim's a mess. If you're serious, make your way to Solitude. Our headquarters is Castle Dower. You find General Tullius there, commanding our forces in Skyrim. But talk to Legate Ricca. She handles the local recruiting. Now, I have to admit, I don't know what other people feel when they normally play Skyrim, but the whole 
the fact that the Imperials are about to behead me right at the start kind of pushes me away from the Imperial side of things, you know? Until next time. Anyways, no altar here, nothing down here, not one in his pocket. Let's do it here. Uh, well, an altar of sorts. Wow. Are you feeling sick? Yeah, something's rotting my brain out. Do you got a cure? <laughs> I protect the Jarl, whoever that might be. Ooh, all right. Oh, oh well. What do we got up there? Ah! I landed in the fire. <laughs> Didn't do anything but landed in the fire. Okay, the enchanter. Ooh, do you got maybe a? Uh, nope, nope, nope. Ooh, sorry, so. If I was a little more accomplished thief in this game, I'd be all on that stuff. This is not the orc you are looking for. <laughs> oh, you know what? I get, I'm going to sell clear some junk out of here. Feels good, but loyalty better. I'm loyal to death. Take a look. Okay. So that's what he has. I want what I have. And I'm going to sell all this heavy stuff. He's got the money to buy all this heavy stuff. When there's enough things, you can just hit it all at once. Imperial Light Helmet. This really lightens the load on my character. Sell one of those. Sell that. Cool. Okay. Brain rod to pyre. It's a trap. <laughs> Whoop. See me at my forge if you need arms or armor. I ooh, I've got that piece of iron. Maybe I can show you all this real quick. Here's the grindstone. There we go. Well, the war axe I can improve. Steel, I don't have steel. I think I can do it with iron and got coal. I ain't gonna mess with it. I'm just gonna work on this. Craft. See? Wanna improve this item? Sure. Yeah, now it does a little more damage. Alright, so I'm gonna save this. Does he sell brains with those arms? <laughs> oh, okay. Tell you what. It's 11.35 now, which is normally, you know, 25 minutes left in the show. And Ergosk is in town. So I'm going to switch characters. I'm going to do what I said earlier. I'm going to take my high-level character. I'm going to go after a giant camp. Just to die for your entertainment. So is that the... Uh, let's see. Yep, that's the last save I have up. So, get to see Thamon at work, my high-level ranger. <clears throat> Alright, now. So, let's check out, like I said, I'm using, one of my mods is Immersive Armors. And I can't, I couldn't tell you how much the difference I see. I'm trying to think of what armor exactly Yordas has on. It used to look blacker and different than that, though. But this arm, uh, immersive armors helps kind of actually hug the female shape a little better. So, I hey, can't complain. By the way, I originally thought you can have, you obviously you have partners in the game. You can have uh, a wife. Originally, I thought I might do that with Yordas. I actually married a chick whose name I really should remember now considering um, the blonde haired girl from Riften in the game 
And right now she's up in solitude. This is uh, my house Carl from Solitude, Yordis, the sword mate. I've got your back. Yep. And much nicer, especially when you go let's see. I want to trade some things with you. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Sounds much nicer than Lydia. Um, so what is she wearing? See, I've renamed it all, so I can't even see. I think this is actually originally orc armor, because you can actually see the, uh, yeah, orcish helmet. Stompers. Yeah, so she's originally got orc armor that she's got on. And she's carrying a bunch of other junk for me. Yordas, you... Lead on. Yeah, you ready to take on a giant camp? There's actually one not that far away. Um, but let's... Go. Oh, oops. No. Sorry. I accidentally put a custom marker. Now I'm trying to get rid of it. Uh, if I had a choice, there's actually a giant camp down by White Run. Let me go to the Western Watchtower. Let's go down there. That'll get me close enough to it. Now, Yordas, help me remember. One, two. I didn't label Dark Fang. That's here. You should be three. You should be four. Uh, huh. Let's do that. That may come in very handy here, so. Weather effects. Now you got the rain. And lightning. There's white run in the distance. There's the bonfire where the giants are at. What the? Oh, no. Pardon me. Hey, can I scare you in there? Maybe I'll scare some of those guys in. Oh, there's one giant separate from the rest. Oh, you are just... You're the one that's going to get clobbered first. You know that. I'm going to be, like, I don't know, over here somewhere. Oh, he's coming this way. That's better. I want him to stay away from the camp, but I want to try to get him... Let's see. I want to try to get him somewhere where I can take some cover and he can't see me so well. Oh, he's still there. I get where I can barely see him in this weather. can go here. Make it still hide a bit. Thought this hit me. And I will do it right after I did that, of course. Uh, true shot. And strength. No? Bigger. I'm going to need that. Oh, I must have missed him. I am missing him. How am I missing him? Seriously, how am I missing the guy? Well, there I gotta do of him. two of them there. 
I am I am so out of. Oop, I'm probably not using the best arrow I can use here. Glass arrows, twenty-three. So using that now. Well, now they're already like must have been something else. But the rain isn't helping me see my target. So I don't want to be this close to a giant. And I'm going to be dealing with two of them in a moment. Seriously? I had to have hit something by now. They dropped Yordas already. strong yours you're sworn to carry my burdens that's my burdens coming right at you almost got him down I need to make sure if yours goes down that I don't hit her This is easier as long as I don't get a melee. I'm surprised that she's. Whew. Awesome job! Wow. How many got a giant's toe? Don't... Oh, carrying too much. Okay, I don't want to be carrying too much. At a giant's feet. I'm going to be able to drop something. As, as you might be able to tell here, my character is a bit of a pack rat. Let's just drop this stuff. Drop, drop these break, drop the helmet. Drop those. There we go. Well, that was the giants, but that's not like the mammoth and stuff. Amethyst. Shaman life boots. Sleeping tree sap. Interesting. These guys carry some interesting stuff. I've never been able to loot a giant before. Oh, let's see what they got in the treasure chest. For hopefully the mammoth comes over and finds me. Does he... The last time I fought giants went a lot worse than that. Ooh, that's, that's pretty good. Problem is, I also know yours is just about full of stuff, so... Grab that. I'm just grabbing the minimum I can that's worth a lot of money. Well, that went much easier than I expected to. Alright, so let's just go hand-to-hand -hand with the Mammoth, right? I still have it at Master Difficulty, don't I, too? I did. Settings. Gameplay. 
master difficulty and I drop those giants like that all right let's see if they'll work on a mammoth or multiple mammoths it might be hello hi yeah I'm say, say hi to the audience Oh yeah, the others are coming. Oof. I can't even see what's going on here. I am chowing down through... Where'd the other one go? Okay. I'm trying to get to the one that was hurt. One down. Gordas! Hey! You know, I should look for... Uh, I am really flying through healing potions here. <laughs> Let's see what else. What other trick do I got? Uh, scroll of call to arms. Forget that. What other potion? Didn't I drink? S I didn't drink this. I didn't drink the strength one. And now I got all right. Healing, 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 healing. They're mammoths. They are. They hit hard. Of no two, both of my weapons leech health back to me, so oh oh hello. Level up. Ooh, I want one left. Where is he? There you go. Uh, okay, I don't like this view. But better than the other end in some ways, you know. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Watch out for the mama mammoth. We are having mom. Uh, we're having mammoth stew tonight. Yours. Thank you for the assist. <laughs> Jeez. Ooh. Oh, carry weight. That's right. I can actually carry a lot more now because I got that potion of strength on me. Which means grab everything and go to the door. Let's see. Where's the other... I think I missed... Where's the other mammoth? There's one lion in here. I was looking for where the third mammoth fell. Here we go. And take that back to town. Well, I got the chance. Actually. Probably grab one more thing over here. Woo! Okay, that was a fight. No telling how many... Uh, I didn't see exactly how many health potions I went through there. That was a lot. Uh, I had linked one major health one to eight and plentiful to seven, and I was bam, 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 bam. I need to look. I heard about you and your curse. I heard about me and my what? curse? Oh, well, I did have a curse once. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't have one now, do I? Dragon skin. Yeah, I don't seem to be cursed right now. Ooh. This, yeah, this is fine. 
all the stores closed on a pack wrap. Let's let's just say that and I will fix that after the show. Whew. Three mammoths at once. That was still <laughs> worth the price of admission, right? Oh. That's okay. We're getting close to the end of the uh, show tonight anyway, so let's close things off here. I'm going to cut the audio for a bit to address the crowd. Thank you, everybody that uh, showed up and joined me tonight. Uh, thanks, uh, Katie Fraggle. You're with me the whole show. Cyrus pretty much the whole show. I don't know uh, who else is all currently with me right here, but... Uh, so let me put some info again up here real quickly. Uh, these, again, are the mods that I was running. Uh, nothing environmental on there. So the environments you're seeing are still regular Skyrim. Like I say, I know there are mods out there that actually have a better environment with actual less work on the processor. Haven't messed with them yet. So what you saw is still most of what you see. Sky UI, I highly recommend that one. It made the inventory and the items a lot more manageable. You go to Nexus Mods for that one. Um, immersive Armors would have changed some things. It would have been small. Uh, Sounds of Skyrim, the dungeons, would have changed that dungeon the audible that I was in. Um, so that's what I had. And now again, our info for Grievance. Uh, grievancegaming.org, join us. We've got... Uh, Groups, just about every major MMO out there. Twitch, you got the Twitch channel that you can catch this show on every other Saturday night. Like I said, right now it's the 17th, and two nights from now is New Year's Eve. Next week is Christmas Eve. Hey. Um, but then like a month out is uh, I've got something going too. So very likely at this point I'm going to say I'm going to be on January the 7th, and that will be the next show. And uh, depending on what we might do, we might just do a little more Skyrim, and I might try to do uh, something new and different on that one. Or uh, Rise of the Tomb Raider, getting close to the end of that one. Definitely going to finish that out some point soon here. So let me take, and so what was the final death count? Three, Horse Stomp. I don't know. I, I would almost like to have ended it with Stomp by a Giant to begin the next show. That would look better. Now I'll start the next show, and whoever missed this one, let's go, Horse Stomp, what happened to you on that third death? You'd be like, uh, <laughs> what do I say? <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah, or die that way. That would have been the way to die right there. All right, so I am going to very soon turn this over to a video. Wall by chicks. W. <laughs> oh, by chicks. <laughs> oh, there we go. They're gonna think a bunch of baby chickens beat me up. All right. So hopefully you like Urgos struggles there too, um, and that's you got to see actually mostly a low level walk around Skyrim, and then you got to see what a high level does even on master difficulty against the giant camp and three mammoths at once. Uh, I'm amazed the giant camp that they did knock down Yordas. That was amazing right there. <laughs> all right. Uh, I'll give a final parting video for all tonight on behalf of Grievance. Again, thank you for watching. Look forward to you all catching the next show. And if you're catching this later on YouTube, hey, give us a like and uh, share it with your friends.